Hello and welcome to tutorial number four in the CB conditional series. Today I'll be showing you how to condition an entire tab off uh, another field value. So in this example I've basically created two tabs, a man's tab and a woman's tab. And we see each one has a single field in it, just as an example. Okay, in this particular uh, profile here. I haven't really set the gender option yet, so they both appear. The idea is to have the man's tab appear only for men, uh, male gender selected fields, and the woman's tab appear only for female gender selected fields. <coughs> okay, so let's just also confirm uh, in the process. Let me just log out here. And we'll see this woman's field and man's field are also available in the sign-up form because the fields have been marked for registration. Okay, this is just a, I'm showing you this because you'll see the results uh, after I configure everything. So let's go here into my tabs management area. And I have these two tabs, man's tab and woman's tab. So let's just go to the man's tab selection. And we see our integration, CB conditional, the first configuration. Basically, you can select, you only have one option here, tab conditions, tab conditional or normal settings. So what I'm basically setting here, again, I'm working on the man's tab and I'm saying if the gender selected is two. So if the gender is female, then what I want to do is basically hide this. And I want to hide it from registration, from profile edit, and from profile view. So hide it in all three areas here. And the second conditional here, there's nothing here. Okay. So let's just save that, save and close. And let's go and look at what we've done to the woman's tab. woman's tab in a similar fashion here I've selected the gender field and I'm saying if the gender is male and then I want to hide the woman's tab from registration profile edit and profile view and let's just save and close so one thing I can let me just refresh the sign up form and what I'm seeing you see these last two fields Okay, if I go and actually select male gender, we'll see only the men's field appears. Female gender, the woman's field appears. So let me just go ahead also and actually sign in. Okay, so we'll see in next login here, next profile. Initially, both man's tab and woman's tab is shown. And, and let's go and edit here also, edit update profile. Okay, we'll see initially we see the ma man's tab and the woman's tab here. Uh, let's click the additional info. And if I go and select male here, up, we see that the woman's tab is hidden. If I select female, we'll see instead of man's tab, we have woman's tab. If I select unknown, I get both. That's all there is to it. Uh, it's quite simple when you see it, but it's a very powerful plugin. I hope this helps. Stay tuned for new tutorials. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.